It's August 17th, 2023. I'm in this. Um, <clears throat> I'm looking back over some of the um, museum literature that the local public front gave me when I went with my son um, to see the museum. I'm also watching some of the um, public broadcast. I went out with for a walk with my father this morning. I ran into some people that I that I well I ran into one person that I knew. Um, and he and I walked looking at the architecture and the design and before we knew it, we were by the water. Um, and we listened to some, I made, he wanted me to listen to some of his music. And then I asked him to listen to two songs from mine. Um, just because there's some kind of Douglas, whatever. And then when I go to the Republic, uh, the American air power, shall I say, uh, in it, it has reference to the sky train douglas and on it it has the 08 um so for me it's really important um these are names and symbols for my journey um as star 8378 um i don't know in but now it's, I'm listening to the song by this person, Bailey Zimmerman. And Bailey, of course, I have such admiration for the Grumman employee, Bailey. Um, I did not really, um, again, we're not talking within my 1970s, like that cosmic nursery. But for the man that arrived, um, that I got to meet with the last name Bailey, um, knowing that he worked for Grumman, it seems significant. And he was well over six foot um, and very... So um, there's a song, He's and now he's passed. So I don't know, do I need to write a letter to Dear in God We Trust or Dear John? That seems to be another one. Um, some things, like if I was... A D8, I mean, it's not sexy, it's it's just, it. she is what she is, and she's on the runway, and she's, like, stuck in this taxi on the runway, and then somebody comes in from, I don't know where, I don't know who would have the authority, maybe in this scenario, it would be, is air traffic control? And they rearranged like where her flight pattern was supposed to go. I think that's a pretty accurate assessment from like cockpit USA in the American air power for my local area. Um, and then I'm going to go up cause Billy Bush just put up, there was this big controversy where he had a transgender drinking bud light. And I'm just like, Oh my gosh. And then I have to, and then that's like a 1975 reference. And then I'm in, I'm going to like, then they put on that there were frogs singing bud. Now I have cliff notes from Iowa. So I know what that's in reference to. And it like makes me want to like perk up just slightly in listening skills. So I'm going to play a clip from this Bailey Zimmerman uh, song. He's one of the new new kid artists. Um, but his song lyrics from country seem like if it's Coach's Call and Coach's Corner, and I really need to get a line in to Dear John or to Dear In God We Trust, um, the song makes sense. It says, stuck between a rock and a hard place. We've been swinging and missing. It ain't broke yet, but 
Damn, it needs fixing. Been a while since you kissed, felt like kissing. It's just different. We've been talking about forever since we've been together. Something about a ring makes you think we're better off with all this. But we're caught in between a rock and a hard place. Red wine and mistakes, tears rolling down your face. When I walked out that door, that's when I lost. Now, it references Midnight in Austin. Um, and there's something that happened when Len came to visit at the kitchen table, blue princess phone in the corner of that kitchen. And it was just he and I sitting at the table. It was just him and I in the kitchen. And I don't know if this is just tales coming back. I don't know. I don't know who walked out the door. I don't know who pulled support. I don't know if that's what happened. I don't know if that's what, like, put my dad in a dangerous position. And then I was on my own. And then, again, it's when, like, I guess the hunting started. Um, It may have happened just prior to that, but again, I don't know the circumstances because it's like being the animal on the game preserve and getting hit with, like, anesthetized, essentially, and then them reversing the agent and then it coming, like, coming back to and not knowing and just some guy with flashing lights all around me saying to come back to him. And I'm like, and he was the one I was to marry, and I'm like, Wait, what? I was like, now now you're confusing me. So, um, anyhow, as far as support goes. Austin, midnight in Austin. Damn, I'm exhausted. What the hell is this all for? Is this where it mends or it breaks between a rock and a hard place? Now, I just learned from Donald Clancy's version of Jack Ryan um, in my life and in my territory, in my area, New York being one of 50 stars with stars and stripes um, and I having my whatever inside something I've never referred to as this, but it would be the HCGH. Um, just a highly sensitive, whatever. I mean, it's, there's, if there's other federations, like, like there's one federation with federal reserve monetary system in this territory within this, whatever. And then there seems to be competing federations. I saw O'Reilly say yesterday on public broadcast to Fanny, whatever, like, you don't want to be an A student here. Like, you want to be a C student in this whatever you're about to whatever in. And then I'm watching Jack Ryan and I'm like, it seems like competing cartels. And I'm in New York and the amount of foreign placements inside of New York, it looks like a powder keg to me knowing that we are the federation that was designated for this area and knowing where my air traffic controller rearranged my flight plan and I know the specific points and it just seems like larger things at play but yet my life never gets better and then just getting more and more sick, but not knowing why and not knowing if it's the detergents, the fuel, the combustible fuels, whether it's bioweaponry, not knowing what it is, but knowing that on the floor of my medical facilities, I have yet to have this, the, like the care and quality that I would believe Godspeed would want for me.
Who's at the defense desk, Austin? By Joe, I think she's got it. O'Reilly says they're on a witch hunt. Now, E-163 with Leland Vittert um, shows this Billy Bush bit. You tell a lot about, a lot about Light? Uh, Bud Light? Not, I haven't sold that many here. That's part of our informal poll at the Iowa State Fair, the Bud Light boycott. Now, this looks like very black operations blacksmith, and that's what they like forced me down the aisle because it just wouldn't leave me alone. And I don't know why. I don't know why it's in my life. I don't know why it collided or quantumly tried to entangle itself with my person. It was not with my agreement. I really didn't want to be anywhere near it when I found out what it was about. But here we are at toilet paper on the bottom of my shoe following me for the last 13 years and I don't know how to get away and it's like just and then it's gotten worse because the walls seem to have caved in on me and I don't like for like if this is vice and virtue issues then why was it ever attaching itself to me it should have never even had the opportunity at star 8378 Boycott continues. No Bud Light being sold at the Iowa State Fair. In fact, the boycott's getting worse since they hired a transgender influencer, Dylan Mulvaney. Bud Light's corporate overlords at InBev reportedly believe sales of Bud Light will never come back. It's hard to imagine, given Bud Light's reign as the best-selling beer in America. Of course, a lot of that was attributed to the company's marketing back when Anheuser-Busch owned it. Good. Good. Now, are they trying to embarrass the Anheuser Anheuser Bush brand? Are they trying to embarrass Billy Bush? Are they trying to embarrass me? I mean, again, I'm in this federal note system. And there seems to be competing federal cartel, whatever, from the heart of New York when I walk around and I've been documenting it on the news, talking about U.S. posts stolen or what it looks like, interference, to say the least. Um, but then I see, turn on the television and I see all of this and I'm like, how do I get a letter to Dear John? How do I get a letter to In God We Trust? Like, what's been done to my person throughout my life journey is not only not fair, but it was rearranged and changed the flight pattern and my destination, which has affected me and my son and all of my children, for that matter. And that's a problem at clocks. Uh, Pete didn't kill you for an ad 
like that. The Bush family no longer controls the beer maker. InBev took over after serious missteps by the Bush family. Billy Bush outlines many of them in his fit. I have cliff notes. In Iowa, that's important. His fit book, Family Rain, that details how the family and then the company lost its way. He now wants to buy the Bud Light brand back, and Billy is with us from his hometown, my hometown of St. Louis. Oh, uh, all right, would the frogs come back? Oh, that's interesting. He's from St. Louis. I had no idea. My father is Louis. Anyhow, I'm going to pause this, and then I'm going to go to see the BS this morning from New York. Um, they've been running this um, commercial for Progressive about Ken and Barbie, um, and it's actually the Progressive person, and he's just talking about Barbie's home, but he's, like, alluding to it, but, like, without, or intimating to it, like, without actually saying anything, and he's like, I don't think I can, and I actually really rather enjoy it, um, but now today I wake up and I put on the See the BS this morning, and it's, it's, it starts with a TSA, so it's airport security, and I'm like, no, I'm watching, and it says clear, and then it has them inside the bedroom, and there's a family trying to not lose sleep together, and I get the overall picture it's painting for whatever may or may not be going on with loyalty and air miles in like New York at this point. I don't know if, if it's happening anywhere else. I assume it is at it's one of 50 stars. I get that. But I had some air traffic control issues with like my flight plan and I'll, I'm like in uncharted territory and I don't know how to get like a message through that like I still need help and I get you busy, but <laughs> it's important. I'm like stuck at Commonwealth in this soup and I don't know how to appropriately communicate. So it's CBS E-164 in the year is 2023. And it says TSA concerns and it says clear. And then it says breeze through airport security with clear. Can't sleep. Just a lot on my mind. I can't sleep either. It only gets tougher with age. Mom, what? Well, knowing Progressive can protect your home, auto, and business should help you relax. Good, because I could use a good night's sleep. Me too. You know how early a chimney sweep gets up every day? Wait, is this all a dream? Why would Jamie be in my dream? I am America's biggest spokesperson. Debatable. I said biggest. Now well, he's got you there. Hi, I'm Michael. I've lost. It's star 1978, star 8378, Nicole Ketterizet's Earth, Solar System, Milky Way Universe, Galaxy is Broken, and it's Bayside Station, Bayside, New York, 11361.